Welcome back. This is Roberto Lionheart, Lionheart Lodge. Back here with more Dungeons 4. Right. One thing I do want to do is slow them down here, just kind of complete that area. Make it less... Make, let them go through there less speedily. Now I'm way over ordering, as it were. But oh. once it's done, oh gosh. A group what I get for obsessively cold met clicking. Before in a tavern, and were literally no reason. Way to their first adventure, but they were not aware of the horrible evils nearby dungeon. Oh, well. It's just a little snot. Who cares? Alright, we should put a door on this. Then pop a door right there. Oh, and over here. And... We're good up here now. In the worst case, at some point, they're gonna... Some heroes are gonna go do some stuff there to us. It's just gonna happen. There's no way we can build on here to make them go through the lava specifically. So we won't. Because we can't. That's okay. And we're done with our over-purchase. So... That was fast. Alright, we do need to socket that last gem, but I feel that we also ought to smash things up top, because we do need, I believe it was five units above level 10, and we also need all faction research at level 10. Enemies have entered the dungeon. So yeah, all those uh, dungeon denizens have been cleared out. So now all we are dealing with is heroes. And they are giving us plenty of evilness uh, just by existing. So that is great. I think we just start... Well, do we start here, or do we start leveling up our undead? I think we do that. Let's get our cathedral, our temple area. We put the temple area here, and then we put the dense... Dense Anomicon or whatever over there. I think that would be fine. We have all this space for a bunch of those uh, ghost, ghostly things. So let's make payday. Creatures are collecting their pay. The dance room. Epic. Grab a door for it. And for there. And for there. Does this one have an exit? No. Not as such. We are going to need a door for our dance room, which is fine. Let's go ahead and pop a door right in here and here. Pretty up the place a little, because that matters. Somehow. All right. Cool. Let's uh, let's go up top and gather. Oh wait, we did, we have we have more. Let's say I gather more evilness, but we have more. So let's go ahead now and 
get ourselves five of these vampire queens. Beautiful. Once their beds are built, we'll take them all up top and start getting rid of these good beings. This time we'll not make the mistake of coming back down with a, uh, with anything. We're up there until we either destroy what we're there for or we die trying. We're, we're not... <laughs> Let's go. This one's a little more obnoxious to micromanage, but we can probably do it. At least for this part of it. <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know. You know what? Whatever. Just have at it, guys. We'll just say, go to here, and an attack move, and when you're done, you're done. A few lone heroes trudge somewhat unmotivated through the countryside. The evilness generating evil would be only too happy to intercept these unfortunate individuals. Alright. Now. Grab these. And we'll pop down here. We'll build the. Oops. Danciness. Necro dancing on. I will never remember that name. <laughs> uh, that's okay. We're also going to... Five necromancers. Once their beds are done, we'll send them upstairs with everybody else. It's a dude who's close, but uh, he's not gonna... He's not gonna get through. There's no way. He must have been skipped by a blob. Yeah, there's the rest of his group. Closer, so we go to the slime ball. Which is then gonna say, okay, that's enough out of you. Let's send as many back as we can. Drop them all right here. Ding dong! It's payday! Yeah. yeah. Not gonna worry the too much about vein it. Then. Is almost exhausted. Your Ooh, enemies are in the dungeon. Don't worry about it at all. Oh, whoops. <laughs> well, I have to wait a little bit longer for their friends to come up. That was funny. Let's go up here. Go stand. go attack because those dudes are going to be a minute re uh, reviving.
Let's let Gorgu come out and play. Gorgu, I want you to do what you're doing and uh, work your way down to there. Oh yeah, I want you to go after that. this. So is there a way, like if I shift click him out, yep, we can shift click him out of the party. Let him go do his thing. Wonderful. We should pop this up to 10. Just so we have it there, right? Alright, let's put all these peeps right here. Is he even going to make it? Uh, maybe. Curious. We'll see. Alright, Gorgu, get it. <laughs> Got to go on. Yeah. Still. <laughs> that worked rather well. We'll send him out after <laughs> more of those. Because why not? Although, let's grab a few of them. Drop them all into here for some light. That did not give us much light, did it? Yeah, not much at all. Alright, what about... A little bit of gold. Get some light with that. There we go. That was a better amount of light. See if they make it. No oh, little zombies running after them. <laughs> Beautiful. Now we can continue up here. Here. Don't see anything over here that needs to be broken, like a statue or anything. Pretty much don't really care about those guys. Payday! Creatures are collecting they want. their pay. Nope. We're gonna end up fighting them. Oh, we don't need them. While we fight, let's go ahead and let them go upgraded. Go upgraded or upgrade or I don't know. However, I meant to say that. We should probably go for the gain and experience, experience now. of all creatures was significantly increased by the stone of finitude. Uh oh. Well, here we go. Make another trip. We will. 
We're gonna make as many trips as it takes to break all of this. In the pursuit of getting everything to level 10 and some dudes even higher than that. The shipment of memorial candles for a century passed close to your creatures. It was time for the immeasurable evil to put out those lights forever and collect some evilness. Twenty-three seconds for Gorgu. Um, yeah, I don't think we're gonna make it. She's being assassinated. <laughs> there were multiple groups there, and I think that was a group that spawned to come into the dungeon, so, yeah. Well, maybe not. Maybe they just have multiple groups standing there. That's alright. Not concerned. Swap this back over to speed. The power of this stone of finitude while we're not up to speedy evil's creatures. I do like having these bonuses available. It is nice. light, because, yes. All right. You want tougher doors, and doors that regen. A construction crew set out to restore the shattered hero buildings. Yeah, I'm not surprised. They usually do something like that at some point. We need 210 evilness to get the last door upgrade. What I like doing with that one is putting it in front of the lava, make them stand there and take more damage. But the other thing is, the final door upgrade makes it to where broken doors are rebuilt without us having to spend any boxes to do it. That's why I want to wait to build them. And then we'll just have our basic doors inside our dungeon and our stronger doors outside. So these will get replaced. Payday. In fact, we can replace these ones right now. But we'll wait until we have the rebuilding ones, the self-rebuilding ones, uh, to put those other ones in place. We have doors everywhere else. Pretty sure we made sure of that already. Okay. So this room is actually going to be next to him, although we don't have the research for it. Okay. That's fine. Beautiful. Let's get those other doors up now. Put one there. Put one there. There. Let's break that one. Oh, that. And put one over 
here. Oh, whoops. I had it selected. <laughs> Alright, so... I believe... From down here, they have... If they enter and they come up this way, they have to just walk around. I don't think there's any lava for them to go through. I lied. There's some right here. Let's put that there. Other than that... I don't think there's any lava on this side. No. Okay. Beautiful. Actually, in all reality, they're not going to come down through, or go up through here at all, are they? That is evidenced by the group that was, that's up here coming through this area. So, technically, we can break that, fill that, and then all this is ours anyway. Then we can technically fill this, but we would have to open it up into here first. So if we do that... We should see this fill. And we should see that fill. Beautiful. So yeah, now this whole area in here is ours. So in order to make sure there's no artifacts hiding, not my dudes, my little snots. Basically, dig all of it out. So I want to know. Your enemies oh, are in the dungeon. Some more. Uh, what you call it? Gold. digging. Is it excessive? Yeah, probably. We're we gonna find some anivores? Almost definitely. Have I done a dig like this in a while? No. Do I enjoy doing digs like this? Actually, yes. I do. In all honesty. A few manivores have appeared yep. in your dungeon. there and take care of them. Because maybe they're not going to keep this going very well. So maybe I should be a little more careful about Mano how often have I... Been discovered in your dungeon. How many and how often I do this. <coughs> with. Your enemies are in the yeah, dungeon. Yeah, probably. Uh, let's keep it on speed for now because of how much I just requested to be dug. And then we'll start going to sections only. <laughs> we have found a few of these. Probably more than a Man few, of actually. Have appeared in your dungeon. Okay. <coughs> we expected this. A group of heroes have gotten lost on the way to their intended quest. Rubbing them out would definitely generate some evilness. Uh, probably. Wow. 
too concerned about it? No. I mean, to a degree, right? But not so much so that there will be issues otherwise. Rebuild itself. Love it. Because of the quantity of them, that's why I have three chambers, just because... One, yeah, it probably takes care of them, but I've seen A dudes get past. Have appeared in your dungeon. Two to three, but nobody gets past that. <coughs> oh, I have had a couple do so. So I say nobody, but uh, it's not entirely true either. No other artifacts yet. Fascinating. We're getting tons of extra money, so that's great, right? But no, uh, no other artifacts. <laughs> have them build a little bit of treasury right here. Oh, looks like the slime ball went. Yeah, that one's not even going to make it back up to the door. He needs to go back and, and group up with his friends and not even going to make that. <laughs> Okay, that's better. A new oh, area we'll has be been unearthed that. in the dungeon. That's it. Oh my goodness, look at that. Maybe it was over here, because I remember having dug out a bit of that. guys right there, but there's a slime ball, so we're not worried. In fact, two of them are about... Yep, two of them are gone, and that dude just got knocked backwards. So, we're fine there. treasury over there just because but uh, yeah looks like we have a little bit of um, monies enemies are in the dungeon yeah kind of <laughs> payday beautiful Beautiful. Nice snots. Your little snots have discovered an artifact. Oh, where? Here. Yep. Here's the extra evilness one. Oops. Took forever to find that one. Put this one up next to that one. It doesn't really matter because it's going to be in the evilness an area. Artifact had been stored and was now manifesting its powers. Beautiful. I really wanted to find it. <laughs> So now we have, there's just piles of gold there. everywhere. <laughs> you know what'll change that? If we go over here and say, let's increase the capacity. And capacity. There we go. Now this room is so empty. Which also means 
We can grab all these. Boy Scout cookies rumbled down the main road. Boy Scout that cookies, That sounded huh? a lot like some easily earned sweet, sweet evilness. I mean, sure, evilness, but cookies, man. Cookies. Come to the dark side. We have cookies, right? That's That's how that works. How's that? Oh, the piles of gold. I love it. I don't care about the mana. It can be however it wants to be. And we should build a little bit of a treasury lore around this. Or vault lore. Enemies have entered the I dungeon. always mess that up. It's fine. All right, so in that regard, we're well beyond where we were, which is great. Uh, this needs to be leveled up. This needs to be bought so we can build it. And we're going to build it in here. Mm, 18 by 12. It's a three by three, which means it's a six by four. Twenty-four. That's that's more than enough. So let's get this filled in along the edges. Get that open there, so we can do that without issue. And then sure. Get rid of the extra wall. Because why not? Doesn't really matter. Alright, this trap. Oh, one of our doors is broken. That's what that is. Okay. Anytime that happens, one of our doors has been broken. Oh no, not one of our doors. <laughs> not the ones we've placed in the way of them. This place is trippy when it's building. And it's got beautiful sounds. We are going to spend some evilness on this. We can't click and drag it. Oh well. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll get more in a minute. In a, in a moment. Let's let them do that first. This ghost army is going to be disgusting. We can send them anywhere at any time and not have to worry about it. In fact, we could even have them be our we can be our guards. We could have them go up top. We could have them anything. <laughs> like we got to break this door. Now they're really grouped up. There's a lots of them there. Oh man, payday. Hope we have enough. <laughs> Alright, we have enough for a couple more of those buildings. So they cost 50 evilness to create them, queue them, build them. But once that happens, the units that come out of these are completely free of any sort of resource upkeep. As long as these don't get broken, you never have to reinvest in these units. You have to place them in here, but you never have to reinvest. We're gonna have fun with this. Maybe it's our ghost army that we send up to the top, I don't know. 
we'll see. You guys do your dancing, have your fun. Here our prison. <laughs> so it's these guys when they die that we want to. Your send those enemies prisons. are in the dungeon. Or not prisons, but uh, what's this one? Oh, this one's one of those super glowy mythics. I call it mythic. I don't know that mythic is the right term. But uh, yeah, Just watch our graveyard for bodies being brought in. That one. And if it's a glowy body, then it's one we want. It's a ghost. You're sending us more troops. Let's make this room a little more efficient next. He's running around in circles, but okay. So is this one worth it? No, nope. enemies this one's are not in the dungeon. It. Is this one a glower? Glowy one? Yep, the war rider is a glowy one. So he's ours. Let's watch for glowy bodies. Oh, there's a glowy body. Why are you even taking it? She's ours. Let's continue making that prison a bit more efficient. Get more evilness off of them. Useful. Glowy body? Can't quite tell. Yes, it was. I mean, we have to get these going for one of the achievements. Here comes another glowy body. In fact, I think I can just pick it up. I don't care about that one. This one we do. So the only other glower we have in here is this one right now. Also, we can make this even more efficient. Oh good, another glower. <laughs> If I really wanted, I think since they have no up upkeep, I think I could fill up this whole area with that, but that would be excessive and take forever. Could I? Yes. Should I? No. <laughs> no. So let's see this guy. Counts as a gift unit, so it doesn't even count against our hey, unit Dave. cap. He has a charge and his melee attack. I mean, yeah. Fantastic. Did the glowy guy go down? See any glowy bodies in here? Ah, there he is. I knew he was close, I just wasn't sure if we'd missed him. Go in there, dude. The last step for upgrading this one is 300. We 
evilness. All right, any other glowers? Uh, there's this one and that one. Oh, one of my peeps decided to come out here. A or a couple of them did. Scout cookies Whatever. Down the main road. That Let them die. Like some <laughs> easily earned sweet, sweet evilness. If that's their desire, then that's their desire. Whatever. Right now we're focused on getting everything up to 10, and then getting our peeps leveled up, and all that. I was about to say, look, they're they're there, but uh, they're they're not quite there. They may also end up fine because those traps and their melee minions are keeping them away from them. I think they're trying to go to their payday all the way up. No. That's ridiculous. Oh well, I'll let them go. I, you know what, whatever. Did one of the glowers come down yet? No. That one's not a glower. Enemies have entered the dungeon. I think one of them did. Must have already been uh, deleted. I uh, don't care about that one. I do care about this one. We're up to eight, which is just over halfway there on extra heroes. And could I grab, to, to, to be perfectly honest, could I grab non-glowy ones? Sure. It just means they start off at a lower level. I'm pretty sure that's all it means. You are idiots. Alright. So. Faction research too low. Pop that, and then we can make things teleport. Our heroes are teleported to the prison upon being defeated. That seems pretty decent. All right, we're gonna go up the top again, and we're just gonna take anybody who's not. A group of heroes have gotten lost on the way to their intended quest. Rubbing them out would definitely generate some evilness. Cool. And we're gonna let's go over here. Because Gorgu's going to go take care of that. He cost us 150 to summon or whatever. And this frog's going to give us, what, a thousand? Yeah. I don't even know if he can be controlled by that hypnotism. Apparently he can. Yep, good thing we didn't bring our other army units over there, or he would have just destroyed all of them. Good job, Borku. Can you get over here, too? I don't know. You have like 30 seconds of life left. <laughs> really doubt it, but we'll see. Oh, maybe. <laughs> I 
Well, I mean, that's a good try, guys. It, it really it is. Start getting them teleporting down into the prison. Thank you, Gorgu. That was very helpful. Very helpful indeed. Alright, you guys. Let's head back over to here. And... Oh, actually. Head back over to here. Okay, hang on a minute. Oh, you little turkeys. Alright. So, we have some guards that we have to have. Not all of them. So, let's, uh, let's go through and get our gift units and make them our guards. Yes, indeed, that was the right choice, and I would say that yes. Yes, indeed, it was the right choice. Okay. Well, we had to split those forces back, and that's fine. It, uh... You know, it's fine. Weird. Last time it, uh, split it more... Put the 20 a lot nicer, if you will. Alright, you guys, over to here. And these guys are supposed to still be in here, but whatever. It's fine. Curious. Armor value needs armor value. That's it. Hmm. And teleport to a job? Sure. It should be nicer. I'll get that up to 10. Okay. Well. We have ourselves a little battle. One which I do not believe we're going to win. But let's get experience going. This gold made all creatures gain experience much faster. Actually, to be fair, where's our stun of healing? So if we do this one, technically, let's our guards regenerate their health. Well, we don't have to worry about it. Yeah. Yeah, there's a bit of death going on here against us. So many assassins. Ridiculous. Alright, well, so be it. Let's also put... Sentry creatures will always gather at the flag. Hey, Dave. So if I put this here, then sentry creatures 
could always be gathered here. Maybe. Let's find out. I mean, he's attacking this. It's gonna hold against him for a while, which is good because they're all over here doing this. Uh, oh good, those can reach him. For now, until they knock him over here. Oh, they didn't. Okay, good. Yeah, I don't think he can defeat the, the door on his own. Oh, now he's attacking that one. Yeah, he's not getting through on his own. It would take extra. So that's good. That is good. This help her regen quicker. No. Enemies are in the dungeon. Well, let's get these going up. Oh, yeah, let's take those. Now there's no ball. No slime ball. Because they're all busy with her. She's almost fully res restored or resurrected or whatever you want to call it. So, we'll be fine. Plus, maybe a couple of them is what actually gets over there. Yeah. Nowhere near all of them. So, it should be fun. And look, the slime ball's back. As soon as he takes any step forward, <laughs> He's going back. So, this rally flag has 750 HP, but it should keep all of our peeps there. Oh yeah, okay, cool. Is there a limit to how much you guys can steal? There's going to be so much of a gold explosion when these guys die. Oh, well. That's hilarious. Uh, yeah. Let's increase the maximum hit points of all our undead. As soon as we can. That's as soon as we can. Cool. Oh. All of our undead, including our ghost creatures, are even stronger. So he's been able to focus that down a bit. For him. Somehow this reaches him. Five, six, seven. I know we have eight of them. Don't we? Two, four, six, eight. Yeah. So then where is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Oh, there he is. Right there. Okay. Yeah, I think keeping them at the rally flag, making that be a thing, I think that's how this room now works. That's good to know. That you actually can have your guard room actually work and be useful. Now this door can restore. And they can go for a ride. Excellent. Uh, yeah, okay. Are there any glowy bodies at the moment? Let's take a look, see. Well, there's an Archmage. No 
Elite Mage, the Pyro, a Forest Blade. Markswoman, Pyro, Pyro, Warden, Pyro. Ding dong! It's payday! Beautiful. I thought it was supposed to teleport them when they were defeated. But maybe if there's a, a cooldown on it. And my little snots are like, no, 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 we gotta do this. Whatever. They'll do what they're gonna do. We have more of these we have to build, too, since that's almost full. Also, since we have more sentries, we can put on sentry duty. Enemies have entered the dungeon. All right, David Cooperfield, you and Widowmaker uh, belong to this room, and that should mean you automatically go to the. Yep. Excellent. Beautiful. Being idiots. Yes, they are. You know, whatever. Whatever. Go ahead and be idiots up there. There's not. It's just a leap. Okay. Alright, I think we can get some more of these built. Let's have them built. Once we get up to 200 evilness, we'll pop that last row and be done building these. Oh, there we go. Enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, I'm glad we figured out the rally flag, though. I it probably told us at some point that that's what it was for. It, it really probably did, and I probably didn't pay attention to it. Okay, guys, the rally flag's over here. Why aren't you at it? <laughs> Stay at it. Thank you. Definitely on track for getting the all of this leveled up. And the stronger we make our undead, the better they will be able to handle the enemies. Because that's the faction we're using as our main battle group, if you will. A gold vein has been mined out. Yeah, that's fine. Find out those gold veins. Gold That's what we want. Oh, right. These guys are still in here. I don't think there's an end to the size of their pockets. I think they can just steal as much gold as, as they want until they're done stealing. Then. When they die, they just drop it all. That little snot's like, let's bring some gold back. And these guys are, ooh, more gold. <laughs> I mean, we still have over 100,000 gold, even with these guys stealing. It, you know, whatever. That's, that's hilarious. I knew somebody was going to get in there at some point. It was just going to happen. <laughs> I 
Oh no, they're stealing our gold. What are we going to do? They're stuck here indefinitely, I wonder. That's my guess. Actually, you know what we should do? Just for them. Let's do this. We can't put it on that tile. Hey, yeah, hey. I was right. We'll put that in there. So if we look at it, it'll explode and deal damage to them, and it only has to be restocked with a little bit of gold and one supply box. And we put that in our vault areas and uh, our treasury areas. And uh, yeah, they're going to be in some trouble. Why not? And just out of curiosity, looking at this one. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, well, this is what we're gonna do for these thieves. We're gonna show them that that's not okay. Can't be thieves, that's bad. <laughs> oh dear. So this is taking a while because we have to get all of that um, research up. According to this. To the max. And then, we also have to get a bunch of units up to above level 10. So we'll do that. And we are about halfway, almost two-thirds of the way there, actually, on this one. So, sweet. We've almost got those achievements, and then we will be able to socket that last socket. So until next time, good luck, have fun, and have a great day.